Friday. Welcome to Friday. Alex and I are in Portland right now. It is my friend Chelsea's grad, well, no, it's not her actual graduation, it's just her wedding ceremony. She's becoming a doctor. She is. So we're here to support and we're gonna go meet her family who's got some seats for us. Yeah, I'm pretty excited. I'm so proud of her. It's gonna be cool. And it's like this huge, we're in this huge arena. She's gonna be down there somewhere. It's gonna be great, I think, I hope. But it's a little chilly here. We're at home. But yeah, just bring you guys along. It is my pleasure to welcome you to our graduate commencement ceremony. This ceremony signifies the end of a journey for our students, recognizes their academic accomplishments, and marks the start of a new experience into the professional role of a healthcare provider. We are so very proud of our graduates, and I congratulate each and every one of you. You may be seated. Chelsea Alexandra Paul. <laughs> Eleanor Roosevelt once said, the future belongs to those who believe in the beauty of their dreams. Dream big. I know you will have a rich future. Like, what do you even? Well, it's for my diploma then. It's yeah, <laughs> but it's huge. You gotta pay another $500 for that. Oh, it's massive. <laughs> stop for snacks because we're all starving. Alex is finishing the last of an amazing, like, when I say amazing, maybe one of my favorite pieces of pizza ever. We stopped at this like little Italian market. But now Chelsea and her friends are gonna take pictures at this gorgeous spot, which is like this little, little overlook here. Freaking fantastic. So we're gonna do that and then maybe not eat anything until dinner. There's like a dinner at seven we're going to. I hope there's more food because I didn't really get a whole lot. Just kind of had some, uh, stole some of, oh my god, I almost just fell in that hole. I uh, just kind of shared some of Alex's pizza slice with him, but we'll see. I won't die. I feel better now that I had a little snack, you. Yeah, it was like, we were super hungry. A drink there, Jules? Real big. Just, you need to take a picture of that. It's just like a shoot dang. <laughs> That's cool though. That's like business. Yeah, it was perfect. 
oyster it went decently well. He didn't want to take it like a shot though. Like, okay. No, he definitely, he definitely did not chew it. But he lived. Oh, he's going for round two. Yeah. Wait, are not you like? Can't you? You can chew it, can you? Another one. <laughs> Why are you so bad at this? What if it just came out of his nose like the clam? The clam chops. This looks good. Gavin's is literally like the craziest mattering. Hello everybody. It is now Sunday. And you will not believe this. So I left Chelsea, everything, it's all great. And um come back home. She's driving back to New York and she's got car troubles. So she stopped in Concord. So I'm gonna meet up with her and Gavin and um, yeah, see if uh, I can figure out what's going on with her car, maybe help if I can, she might need to stay. Who knows, we'll find out. Oil's good, yay. You're so excited, so excited. It's so great. Don't worry, it's not raining or anything. Oh, it is. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. Just All right. So, not only is it like not working, oil's fine, but they're also towing a trailer. So, there's only like four and a half hours left in the trip. It's fine. For this one, I don't know. Yeah. It's, you know, just like 30. Yeah, and then hours. getting to Colorado. It's fine. It'd be great. It'd be great. I mean, she started. They're uh, gonna take off. Hopefully, I don't get a call. Hopefully they're fine. Hi. But man, if it's her fuel pump or something, it's gonna suck. Seems okay right now if they go slow. But going all the way to New York, that's where she's going, that's where she lives, so it's where she's gonna like get all of her stuff before having to go to Colorado. It would just be really, really hard and bad to have to go so slowly the whole way. But we'll see. Now, not gonna lie, I'm out. I might go to Marshall's. Yeah. Totally vlog fail and forgot to film anything in Marshall's. Went home to pick up Alex though, because we're at the movies with Adam. Uh, we're gonna see Deadpool 2. And um, apparently when I was home, I totally forgot, slipped on my Crocs and then forgot to take them off again. So, apparently we're doing that. Mm -hmm. It's awesome, I'm so excited to be in public in this. I'm not, it's not going well, it's not good. Movie's over. We're on to Target. Yeah. Yeah, we are. Um, movie was good, we liked it? Yeah, it was super good. Yeah. It, um, if you're wondering, Deadpool. Good stuff, but Alex needs some stuff for travel. A little shave cream or other yeah, shave cream? Yeah. Some stuff, some stuff. I mean, I'm never gonna say no to Target. I don't need anything, but you never know what you can find. I could find something amazing or just nothing and save my money. That would be good too. It's really just hit and run. Not a lot of fun. That was the most fun. What are you talking tiny about? Little, tiny little things. And we had the announcement of like, you better leave or we're gonna close you in the store. Got it all though. Oh my god, they have to like box up their pop sockets. So nobody steals them, apparently. They're on the TV. Inception. <gasps> Remember to grab your receipt.